thank everybody. I hope everybody's safe. Um, you know, we, uh, we're going through unprecedented times right now. It seems like things are changing daily. Uh, I know we were supposed to have a presser before we started spring ball last week. So really, my goal today is just kind of give you an update on everything and how we're operating. Uh, you know, just the timeline of the events, you know, I think it was uh, last Thursday that, uh, you know, we told our players that uh, there was no need to come back to campus and to go ahead and return uh, to home from spring break. So we were in the process of getting all that information out to our players. Uh, really, this week, uh, it's real simple. Our number one goal is the safety and well-being of our players, uh, the safety and well-being of our coaches and their families. Uh, we've been in constant contact, our coaches have, with our players this week, making sure that they're safe, uh, making sure that uh, they're set up remotely uh, to be able to start their classes um, and everything, you know, that goes with that. Uh, currently, all our players are healthy. You know, we've, we've uh, given them all the information on the symptoms of the virus, and we've asked them to communicate uh, with Dr. Goodlett, um, you know, if there's any issues uh, that come up with that. And of course, we've educated on uh, the social distancing and, and how to operate, uh, clean their hands and everything that goes with that. i uh, really like to thank our leadership, Dr. Goose, you know, Alan Green, uh, Commissioner Sankey. Um, you know, in those trying times right now, I think they've done an excellent job. And really, I think my goal is uh, try to try to give you all a weekly update on how we're operating with everything changing. So uh, with that being said, I'd like to open up with any questions. Yeah, Coach, this is Sarah on Eli, CBS 42 in Birmingham. Um, just curious in regards to working out spring practice, obviously that's not happening. What's your communication with players when it comes to staying in shape, workouts, or stuff that they're doing individually while they're at home? Yeah, really, uh, you know, the, as far as that, it, it's the, the number one thing is the safety and well-being of our players during these times that, you know, uh, with – the way things are changing. So really that's what we told them, you know, uh, during spring break, they had some little things they could do, but this week it's all been about just health and safety. We put the football on the back burner um, and just making sure that, uh, that they're safe and, and protected. It's just, we're taking it week by week. Um, we'll get to that point after we get through this week, you know, obviously we'll have staff meetings, um, you, you know, it's, Friday and Monday of each week, and we'll talk through those things. And at the right time, you know, we'll be prepared to, to, to move forward with that. But, you know, right now that with the social distancing and everything, I mean, weight rooms are, are, aren't where you're supposed to be. So really, you know, each week we will, um, you know, come up with different plans that are appropriate at the appropriate time. You know, I, I believe I've talked to, I think, every player this week, uh, myself individually, I know that our uh, offensive and defensive coordinators have communicated with both sides of the football, and then their position coaches communicated on a daily basis with our guys, you know, uh, which we think is real important, especially with the way things are changing. And it seems like every day there's something new, and we just want to make sure that our guys are communicated with and taken care of, um, you know, as we get through this. Tell me about how this affects recruiting, just how you guys go about trying to identify the kids you want to recruit and, and, and making them offers and how you can even do that when you can't really see them play? Yeah, you know, the, the technology piece, uh, you know, is, is really good. So, you know, each coach has uh, from home their own, uh, you know, laptop and they can watch any video. There's great communication. We have great leadership. Our coordinators and, and uh, you know, Coach Travis Williams, our, our recruiting coordinator, they're, they're doing a great job as far as making sure that we don't get behind and working from home in the communication that they have. And, you know, right now there's, you know, you got the ability to uh, communicate, you know, with, with recruits and I'm sure other staff are doing that throughout the country because uh, most of the kids aren't in school now anyway. 